Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Jennifer Scrappy and Kane. Today I'm sharing an 8.5 by 11 layout. And I'm using up some stash. This is a mini selfie kit that was by Echo Park. It's actually called Selfie. And it had about six papers in it and one sheet of stickers, which I'll show here in just a minute. That's a 6 by 12 instead of the regular 12 by 12. And all I have left is a couple of the 12 by 12 sheets and that floral piece that you see going in diagonal. And I put the rest of the paper into my stash. The 12 by 12 and the floral one I don't use on this layout. And then the stickers um, I set to the side. I'm going to try to use up a few more of them. And for the most part, I'll probably give them to my uh young cousin and she'll play with them but i'm kind of done with them uh i created two other layouts with this kit also so this is my third layout and here i'm getting started on the layout and i'll pop up the sketch up in the corner the sketch is by jessica michaels i uh kind of followed it i took her idea of the stacked photos and then after that um i kind of ran for it with my own idea but the stacked photos inspired me to do this layout here of these cute little selfies of my son playing with Snapchat. And it was around Easter time, so the little bunny ears and carrot were part of the filter. <coughs> Sorry, and <laughs> losing my voice. Um, so on the photos, you can see I stacked them on negatives. Uh, those were from... I'm not sure where those were from, but they're just negative strips that I had in my stash. So I put his two photos on white cardstock first, and then I put them on the negative strip. And I placed pound happy, or hashtag happy selfie, dating myself, because, you know, we all know that's a pound sign, right? Um, anyways, <laughs> here I'm just adding play foam to the back of the cut file, and this cut file is easter fun i believe i found this in just the silhouette store and i used scraps to back it with colorful papers that match the background paper and i absolutely love this background paper i want i knew this one i wanted to use when i saw it and it was perfect to use you know with the selfies and then i added a little bit of easter theme to it by adding the cut file and these chipboard pieces which are also Echo Park, but they're from an older Easter collection. So the stripe paper, I'm going to add up there at the top. And then I'll add these two camera stickers uh, that I placed together. And I'm going to put a uh, hashtag snapshot up there. And that was just to add a little something up there. It was kind of empty. So I added that up there at the top. The chick does not make it onto the layout, the little chipboard chick, but the Easter basket does. So I went ahead and kept the Easter chick, and there's a little uh, chipboard piece that said Happy Easter that I showed also. And that also went back into my little stash. Hopefully I'll get it onto a layout. And here I'm just adding my title down at the bottom. Like I said, that's a cut file, and then I'll add the selfie sticker down at the bottom with the title. So the title will actually be Easter Selfie Fun. And then I'll add the little Easter basket over there in the corner by Fun. And I believe that's it. This was a pretty quick layout. Um, it was pretty simple when I found the sketch and then was kind of inspired just to go from there and run with it. So... And I got these cute little photos scrapbooked, and I got a little rest of this kit out of my stash and into the album. And it's really pretty colors, and it worked perfect for Easter. So I should have a few more layouts this week. Uh, one for, um, what will I have? Oh, I'll have acrylic stash bash coming up on the 28th. And then... Um, tomorrow, which is the 27th, I should have another Easter layout, actually. Um, and then I will have one more Easter layout for, uh, using up 
the Color Rush Studio kit. And that'll be it, I believe. And then I'll have on the 30th, I'll have one more layout for uh, using 30 days of sketches. But other than that, I should have quite a few layouts for you guys to be inspired by, hopefully. And as you can see here, I'm kind of piecing the sticker back together. And in the end, it's not long enough to reach from top to bottom of the layout. And at first I was like, oh, it's okay. I'll just leave it. And in the sketch, Jessica has like pattern paper or something on the sides of her layout. So that's what inspired me to use these stickers and use the border strips. And eventually I end up going ahead and just cutting this one and stretching it to go across the, make it into an 11 inch border. I had used a piece of it on one of the other layouts. So I didn't have a full piece, but I wanted to add two to one side and two to the other side. So I just stretched it and it looks okay. I'm going to go ahead and leave it. And that's going to be it, guys. I will see you tomorrow, hopefully, with another layout. Thanks. Bye.